we're protecting the country and providing a defense um, product. And you know, now that I'm living in the community, I thought, well, what better thing can I do in order but to work with the folks that are having the roughest, roughest times, the folks that are in difficult circumstances, maybe weren't raised uh, in a home that was you know, supportive and helpful, and you know, maybe work with those folks to figure out how to solve their problems and help them you know, move forward after maybe a justice-involved situation or after they've been involved in substance abuse or maybe were incarcerated either in prison or jail. And that was really what motivated me to come to the Department of Corrections. When I came here, I was still working at McDonald's and I found out about the Department of Corrections through my National Guard unit. Well, there, there is quite a bit of similarities uh, as far as like, you know, having each other's back and, you know, the integrity. And... I think the transition between the military and DOC Pretty similar, yes. They, uh, you know, you at the time we wore black boots, so we were all polished and shined. Same thing here, you know, you have to be presentable, your boots have to be shined. So that was really similar to me, and the rank structure was so much so close. And then the family feeling of the Department of Corrections closely resembled the family feeling of the military as well. If I had my bad day, someone else was there to take care of it and help you, even if it was just listening to you. I deployed shortly after I became a member, or after I started here at the Department of Corrections, six months, I believe. Um, I deployed to Iraq. My son was born three days before I deployed to Iraq. On Valentine's Day of 2004, he was born. Half the people here still didn't really know me, only being here six months. And some of that time frame, I wasn't even here anymore. And they all piled together money around Christmas time and bought my, my son Christmas presents delivered to my parents house. Um, I would have to say your your bonds with your co-workers is definitely a lot different here. You have to watch each other's back, you know where you are 24-7. You're together five days a week, eight hours a night. You're in stressful situations. You build a family just like the military does because you go through those experiences together and it's it is a different environment just from your staff. I come from a military background. I joined the military straight out of high school, and um, we decided, my wife and I decided we kind of wanted to start a new chapter, and the Department of Corrections seemed like it had a lot of structure. I think one of the things I learned a lot when I was in the military is really having dedication and pride into what you're doing. Um, the same thing can happen with a lot of our clients. If you put dedication into them, take pride in what you're doing, we can really have the success with some of our clients out there.